Uh, let's see. Steam trap. I don't think I've ever used that. What does the steam trap do? Levitates enemies. Mm, mixed feelings. Whoa. Okay, what are we looking at here? What is this? Oh. No, I'm actually not sure what this is on the map. Can I check? It looks like a door that just might not be active yet. No, it's... What? Okay. Well. Hmm. Hot take. Okay, yeah, it's getting a little choppy here and there. Weird. Hey, thank you, Lance, for the three-month resub. A little late, but I appreciate you being a good ally. I try. I wish I was better at it, but I just, I don't know. I... I'm not going to say I'm more of a follower than a leader, but I sometimes kind of am. Okay. I don't think I want the mana well. I don't think the mana well was as useful as I was hoping it would be. Anyway, let's let's try for weird defense. What I'm going to do is I'm going to force them to come down here and then go back up the stairs out there. Some of them might do it normally. I'm not entirely sure. But it seems like this would be such a good spot to just, like, get stinky. Problem is, corridors are damn wide, so it's kind of hard to go with the arrow traps. But it is what it is. I'll be okay. Yeah, so what does the ally tag mean? I mean, effectively it means that I try and uh, create a healthy and wholesome community uh, that is friendly to LGBTQIA+, but also, like, really everyone. Well, I guess it's everyone that kind of uh, agrees with that specific mindset. I don't know, it's weird. Because I don't want to make, like, a, a space for everybody. There are, there are some horrid people out there that I do not want to have in my community. Uh, but in the case of, you know, LGBTQ, especially, that's what it is. So do I want to just get some air traps? Oh, no. Bad news, bears. I forgot there were flyers. I forgot they exist. Maybe I should have actually just got brought a bunch of the shooter dudes and just gone nuts with it. That's eh, fine. We'll be okay. I'll just keep an eye out for them. They're pretty obvious. And not terribly... Terribly durable. I wonder if I could actually put, like, a shock trap on the ceiling to get them. Okay, there we go. And luckily, they have a very long path to have to take. Question. Aha! It works! Instead of shooting them, I can just hit them with a... Uh, super Splash. Okay, question. Uh, uh -huh. I'll just put that there. Hopefully that works the way I, I'm intending it to work. Because, yeah, if we're really lucky, I can just put a couple of those traps along the ceiling there. And that'll just take care of the flyers before it ever... Why am I shooting these guys? Okay. Hey, thank you, Crystalon, for the 43-month resub. Thanks so much. God, this acid flask is just, like, the most choice choice weapon. I don't think it exists in uh, the future games. It might be in Orcs Must Die too. It's definitely not in 3. I found the weapons in 3 to be a little bit disappointing. Not bad, necessarily. Just a little on the disappointing side. Uh, let's see. 
What do we do on here next? Well, are they busting out of this door yet? They haven't yet. Yes, they are. Can you put shock traps uh, under the archers? Uh, yes. So I, I could actually maze the enemies directly below the archers and utilize that. All right, let's see if those shock traps work against the flyers. Yup. Oh, it's perfect. Yeah, just, just having those two shock traps there uh, didn't get rid of all of them. Okay. Yeah, so it looks like a couple of them are still making it through. Well, it's fine. It doesn't need to be perfect. It just needs to take a couple of them out. Alright, so do we want to... I mean, do we want to take some barricades and kind of maze here? I do like the idea of being ultra stinky with this. Oh, never mind. I can't put a shock trap underneath. That kind of ruins the mystique of it. I'll just probably pepper this area with just bad. Burn him and then burn him again. Boy, you could turn on a dime in this game. There we go. I like the fire traps because they don't have to worry about hitting the kobolds. It's just kind of... Well, I'm not going to say it's instantaneous, but... Okay. We good? Yeah. I'm just going to line a bunch of fire traps. They haven't even reached the turnaround point. That's a beauty part of this build. I don't know. That's one thing I really like about Orcs Must Die. It's not a balanced game. I think maybe that's part of the reason why I didn't like Unchained so much. It's like it was fun, it was fun to play with friends, but it was a little grindy and it was too balanced. Because you couldn't do weird exploitative shit like trick, et, uh, trick enemies into walking whole corridors before they even... Uh, before they even get to the meat of your defenses. I'm noticing they're shooting my archers up there. I don't know how effective they're being at it. But it's a little spooky, because I hate to lose them. Okay, now do we... Yeah. I'll put that there. We'll just kind of... Spread the love. There we go. Okay, we got flyers coming again. Yeah, they seem to be more more or less good enough against the flyers. I might I might want to mess with the shock traps just from a like a novelty perspective. Oops, well that certainly didn't well. I guess actually that did work. Oh, sometimes there's like three flyers that come through. Yeah, the shock tra traps are good. I I knew they were gonna be decent, I just didn't realize they were gonna be that effective. I wish I had like a, uh, let's see, like a better way to track them down. Maybe if they had the ceiling blisters again. I usually kind of stay away from those. Uh, let's see. Because they're kind of expensive, but like, you know what? I might as well try other things just because. There we go. They have... Was that archers or flyers? I think it's our... Oh, no, they have an ogre. Flip side, I'm not terribly concerned about the ogre in this... In this lineup. 
That ogre is going to be soft by the time it gets places. It's a little weird to be referring to an ogre as soft, but you know what? I'll take it. Well, they don't just have the random skull drops an anymore. At least not that I've seen. I guess it makes sense. This is a little bit more immediately... Uh, more balanced feeling? Question mark? I don't know. Okay, do we want to just... Yeah. Just line that shit up. We're here. And that area tends to put out archers anyway. Hey, Shrek has a soft side. I mean... Does he? Huh. Well, that kobold figured shit out right about there. I guess I could do this. Oh, they killed my archer. Rude. That's part of the reason why I don't invest too hard into the archers. Oh. There we go. What I get for not paying attention? Well, the flyers almost made it by. There we go. Okay. Onwards. So, oh shoot. Let's uh, let's go back out to the campaign menu. I got some skulls to spend. Also, how many levels do we have left? Uh, a fair bit, actually. I mean, I could potentially just go all in and finish this today. Not a bad idea. All right. Uh, let's see. So I like I like this. Holds an additional lightning charge. Wall blades do more damage. Push trap stun. Barricades are cheap. Barricades are cheaper. I gotta go for that. Now nah, let's go with the storm zapper. Let's go with this. I forgot that I even played Orcs Must Die one a while back. Also, thank you, No Named, for the nine month resub. OMG, didn't know you still played Orcs Must Die. Can't wait to watch the VOD. Yeah. I, uh, I mean, I'm a huge fan of Orcs Must, Orcs Must Die, and I wish I could play it more often. Uh, it's just, you know, it's a little repetitive. Oh, gosh. What is. Oh, no. Okay. I don't like this map. This map gives me the spookies. Because here's the problem. We got two paths. Okay. We got two paths. Big issue is these staircase jerks are going to be able to get by me. All right. Wow. That is not actually that much cheaper. I was really hoping it would be. Oh, shoot. Uh, we got a new slot. What do I use it on? Or there's the spring traps, which are kind of tempting. I might want to do tar traps. Just to slow them down. Okay. Honest question here. Yes. So, I don't think it would be worth it. But what I could do is, I could actually just barricade off one of these. Just from here to here. Just make this one unavailable, so I only have to defend the other. Archers for the balcony. Maybe. I, I have mixed feelings on the efficacy of the archers. They're good, but they're not that amazing. Okay. Oof. Dab, 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 dab. 
But that, but that. Oh, we just. Okay, we end up here. This is a doozy of a level. Where are they coming from? They're coming from the other side. So let's focus the other side. This has two. We need less than that. This won't hurt a bit. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. I think I'm just gonna go hard on on arrow traps. Cause they, they clearly shred. Remember barricade breakers. Are they on this map though? Because I know they exist in, like, Orcs Must Die 2 and 3. I'm not sure how prevalent they are in Orcs Must Die 1. And if they show up, then we just restart. I didn't see it at the, uh, the top of the map, though. Okay, I'm going to put that there. Some extra fire plus flips him back backwards, kind of. If we're lucky, it just alternates between the two, and I don't have to get attacked on both sides. Boy, that acid flask is just the most busted thing ever. I think it's supposed to be a DLC item. But it just melt melts small dudes. Okay, let's just do that. Doesn't look like they're busting the other side yet. Okay, let's just leave them with that. Yeah, problem is a bunch of archers kind of annoying. Kinda, there we go. Nope. Well, that didn't work. It's okay. Alright, they're attacking from the other side. The map has gone empty and I'm not digging that. says unleash the horde but i i have no idea where the horde is even coming from well time to do it yep figured as much luckily i can just turn this into arrow hecktown and that usually solves most of my problems i feel bad because like i want to use other things but it's just like no trap has quite the coverage that the arrow trap does Not even close. That's gonna leave a mark. Luckily, it's perfectly acceptable at, uh... uh let's see, it's per perfectly as acceptable unupgraded, at least in this game. In the later games, you want the upgrades for... Gosh, was it bleed or was it fire? It was one or the other. They shot my poison thing out of... Or my acid flask out of the air. That's Omega Rude. Okay, there we go. Now, it's telling me to unleash the horde again. I get the very distinctive feeling they're going to be attacking on every side. Put, put an archer here. Here. Okay, they're coming this way. That's easy. Oh no, they're coming they're coming from both. That's that's good fun. Uh 
I'll just have to keep an eye on Arrow Hell. And hope it's good. Well, Arrow Hell certainly seems to live up to its name. Okay, where are they coming from? Luckily, the teleporters are incredibly effective here. There we go. There we go. Kind of. I'll just keep an eye on the other one. I get the feeling they're not going to send anything particularly stinky at me. He, yeah, he he's not dead. Okay. So I'm going to get another one of those. How are they doing? Yeah, just error corridor seems to be handling this and then some. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna spread it out a little bit. I don't think this game had the endless mode that two added. I'm actually I'm really impressed with this game from like a functional perspective, but I can definitely tell that like two two is definitely the kind of magnum opus in comparison. This is such a good foundation though. Like, it's always nice when you have a game where if, oh no. Was it an ogre? Shit. You know, I'm not going to redo this level. Yeah, it was an ogre. I didn't even notice it there. Ugh. That one's tough. I'm sure we get way less skulls for it. Four. Actually, that's fine. I'll take it. Sludge hole is stinky anyway. Who are you? What? What are weavers? I was a lousy teacher, but he was the worst kind of student. Dim-witted, foolish, and too stubborn to focus on the fundamentals. That's why the order paired us up. They sent their best and brightest to learn from other more patient war mages. I got the bottom of the barrel. The joke's on them. Those brilliant young minds are dead, along with most of their masters. Slaughtered, trying to defend the rifts. The world is still doomed, of course. There aren't enough war mages left now. Though I laugh if the last one left standing is him. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh, okay. So we've got two pathways here. Neither connects. Both, I think, are active. Open we- Oh. Select Weaver. Steel Weaver. Wait, what are these? Improvement for player weapons and spells. Orcs killed by traps and guardians earn more coins. What is this? Oh, okay, so we have two different weavers. It's a weird meta, pro well, not meta progression, mid-run progression thing. So I can invest in spell cost or cheaper, flame crossbow and holy sword. Stun area, player health doubled. But yeah, in-map upgrades. The I, I actually really wish they kept with this idea. This is really cool. Okay. So it looks like I'm going with uh Very well, then. Steel Weaver, but that's fine. Decisive. I like that. 
I just like orcs killed by traps and guardians earn more coins. Like that's really solid. Could go for guardians, but um, and it's fine. Okay, so they're coming in through here. We do have kind of a good spot for flipper traps if I wanted to go that direction. But, let's be honest here, we're going Poison Flask, Arrow Wall. You know, not necessarily a bad spot for the Storm Zapper, too, if I wanted to go that direction. Let's see, what am I missing? I mean, I guess I might as well grab the Storm Zapper and... I'll grab the Guardian. Okay. It looks like they're attacking on both sides. So I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna chunk them there. It looks like they're coming this direction. Perfect. Pick the right one. So, as far as catapulting the enemies into the pit, the main issue is just, uh... Coverage? Question mark? Uh, that it's it's kind of expensive to get enough flipper traps to actually send, send them into the pit from here. Whereas, I could just have a, uh... A giant stinking, um... Like a giant stinking line of arrow traps. No finesse. And it'll pretty much shred everything that comes through it, save for ogres. Who I have to keep an eye out for. I'm very bad at keeping an eye out for ogres. Right, I should probably also not be killing anything. Unless I have to. I forgot. I also don't have a choice up here. Okay. Oh, luckily, I've got a fairly long run-up here. So I don't have to worry about too much. Okay. That's about the extent that I'm going to get. And they're coming from the other direction. Portal is here. Oop, portal is here. There we go. I forgot about Null Hunters. 